Hey guys, Memory Sports Cards here. Um, sorry about that. I had a mistake. My camera fell over. So I deleted the original video. I will just show you what I got so far. Um, went to the first card show in a while this weekend. Picked up a 1975 Topps rookie infielder. Card with Phil Garner, Keith Hernandez, Bob Sheldon, and Tom Ber Ber Berzer. And then I also picked up... A 05 Classics, Thomas Triples, Fran Tarkenton, Eli Manning, and Lawrence Taylor card, numbered 391 out of 500 for my Giants PC. Uh, so far with the cards, I've gotten a 2020 Playoff Tommy Stevens that actually came with this Xavier McKinney. Both of them are the blue parallel. A 1960 Tops Detroit Lions team set card. A Saquon Barkley 2020 Legacy Red, numbered 33 at 299. McKinney, a Corey Washington Gold, numbered 17 at 50 autograph gold refractor from Chrome 2014. A 1979, yes, wait, 1977 Top Spanish El Chicantes Brian Kelly card. Those are pretty expensive, so when I find them, I buy them. 2004 Prestige I Killiard and 379 Tops Van Horn, Jimmy Robinson, and Emery Moorhead. So, those are the cards I picked up so far. Let's try to fix this camera a little bit. There we go. Let's see how I do with the rest. I'm not putting the the uh, vintage cards and holders yet because I'm doing the set. So I want to put them in a box, uh, a storage box, shoe box. So the 60 Detroit Lions and the Bog Gain 1960 Tops. Yeah, that's got to be it. Let's see. There you go, Bob Gain. So this has to be it. Uh, there's some showing of the comic on the back. I'm not too worried about that. But that might be the only 1960 pickup this week. And unfortunately, no grades to the games lately. That's been really tough to come by. Uh, you bid on them, and people are just starting to bid more on them uh, a little bit. So, 2020 Phoenix uh, picked up the McKinney Base Rookie. So that was a nice pickup. an auction it was really cheap so I just picked it up I'll probably uh, try to get more of them for my holiday break next year so I'll hold on to this it's not like I need to open this right away I got it for about a dollar 1989 tops football pack unopened so the guy had a perfect record, so I don't think it's been ever sealed or uh, unsealed. Just make sure. He sealed it really well, though. Some gum dust, but yeah. So it's not. I don't know if it's. You know, it doesn't look like it's been open. So that's good. I mean, not like it's an expensive pack anyway. But it's cool to open some old stuff in your uh, Christmas break. And I'm trying to start collecting sets early for that. Pick this up via eBay. The Prism 2020 Xavier McKinney Green Parallel. That's retail exclusive usually. Uh, need that for my set. Looking for the 
this one. So I picked that up as well. Um, like I said, it's a retail only, so I'm just going to split my bikinis from the rest. That was a nice pickup for me. Uh, didn't pick, I actually paid a lot for that one. So. Next one is an interesting one. Uh, I'm not picking them up to keep them. To be honest with you, uh, the Mets traded for him, so I decided to hold on to this card a little bit and see what happens. I just, I know that he's a pitcher, but I'm willing to take a chance. If he does well, I made a great move. Uh, I'm starting to pick up Jordan Yamamoto stuff, and this is a Bowman Chrome Purple Refractor, number 39 at 250. As stated, the worst that happens, he's not as good as they say he is, and I don't lose anything because I didn't pay much. And I at least make my money back. Which is the risk you take. There's one that I think I'm going to be a killer on. Uh, pick up wise. Alright. It wasn't this one though. 2020 Absolute. Red Square. 113 out of 199. Xavier McKinney. So another McKinney. His stuff's starting to go up since he started playing. So uh. I'm going to try to get what I can, but I'm not going to overpay for his stuff when I got so many good ones already. Uh, I would have liked him to got one guy snipe, sniped me on the Optic Preview Gold last minute, and I would have paid more for it, but he just came back last minute and responded. So that sort of stunk, but it happened. Next card up is a card I used to have. I've been looking for this one uh, to bring back into my collection for a long time. He was Hunter on TV, and he used to be a Giant before he was a Ram. So for me, this is a nice card to get. 1970 Tops Fred Dreyer card. This is his rookie card. So, like I said, I like this card. And I think it could, you know, 1969, but his rookie card was 70. You know, I just like that card. Picked this up very cheap. I'm surprised I picked it up so cheap. A uh, Darius Slayton 2019 Press Proof Blue Rookie. So adding to the Giants PC again. So I think about 90% of the stuff will be added to the Giants. This one won't be. <laughs> Pick this one up too. Tops Chrome Blue. Uh, Tops Chrome Sapphire. Edition Jordan Yamamoto Rookie Autograph. I think, I don't know if this is a refractor or not. It's not. But it's a nice autograph. And the Sapphires seem to have value after, if they're good enough. I really think the Alamano stuff's going to start going up. I may be wrong, but I may be right. Next one opened up is a Andrew Thomas 2020 Donruss Press Proof Silver. Numbered... 10 out of 40 out of 100. Yeah, 40 out of 100. So this is a nice Thomas. His stuff is fairly expensive for a card that, you know, for a rookie guy. Oh, this is a lot. I want to. Okay. I've been on these as a lot. One card I've been on just to hold on to. I guess he has a good season. She was starting out last. Sorry, I don't know what this guy did. Approach that way, okay. So, uh, I just picked this stuff up. Well, two of them I needed the Tiki Barber Mosaic Orange and the Tiki Barber Pink. Just for the heck of it, a Denzel Mims Emergent, like I said. 
They were cheap enough. They had free shipping. I think I won this for like 25 cents. So I'll put it at a dollar and see what happens eventually at card shows. He's worth the risk, I think. He has a good season. No reason I won't really open the stuff on the video. Is because of uh, people's addresses and I don't have permission, so I should do it this way. Pops Platinum, Jonathan Hankins, Orange Rookie. Not numbered, but still a nice card. This was really cool. Pick this up. It's a pretty instant black and white Xavier McKinney. They're not numbered this way, but they are numbered on the back one of 518. So that's 518 of these. I didn't have to bid on it that long because nobody else bid on it. So I got lucky that one. Pick this up as well. Joining Yamamoto, Prism Blue, numbered was numbered I thought but maybe not is a blue so not numbered from what I see but very nice card to have and he's here for McKinney red white and blue prism for my McKinney P P PC from 2020 just trying to uh, cut down on time a little bit the Aaron Rodgers, Christian Kirk, Brett Favre, and Jerome Baker. Put these in the pile. That was uh, the Railway and Blue Retail Prism. So that's a pretty nice pickup. Just whatever. I have this already, so I'm going to put it towards my sales collection. 2020 Mosaic Orange. Reactive Orange. Uh, Tiki Barber. So, I got an extra one, I guess, by mistake. Yeah. Happens when you buy stuff online, but doesn't hurt. And a 2019 score, Daniel Jones Red Parallel from the NFL Draft inserts. Twenty twenty optic blue autograph number twenty five out of one twenty five. The last card was a twenty ten, I think. Yeah, twenty ten limited Del Schaffner legend card number four ninety five out of four ninety nine. These two, I think, are more weak because they're lots. Yes.
Panini XR rookie autograph 101 out of 199. Uh, just trying to figure out if I can put. Let's go to the side for the McKinney really quick. Something is really a base card. Sorry, I'm just trying to get everything set up properly with the McKinney. Twenty twenty three Prism Michael Strahan Green Prism I actually bid quite a bit on this one. 2020 Panini Contenders, Xavier McKinney, Rookie tiki, Ticket Autograph, the variant version. So I got the variant of that. His stuff's expensive on that set, so it's going to be tough to get the base. I may just wait a while and pick it up. Eventually, the contender pr prices of the normal cards are going to go down, I would hope. Oh, this is another break that I did. Okay. So, this was a break I did on a line of uh, Absolute. Barkley and Slayton. Stargazing Barkley. Red Zone Barkley. And the McKinney Base Rookie, which I already have. But, I could use these. And, to be honest, it's not a big deal because I can always use McKinney's in my collection. So, I buy Giants, I don't keep Giants at pull, and I live in New Jersey, I don't have Giants product. So if I get doubles of things, I try to use them towards sales. This was a nice pickup for me. Uh, I've considered a steal. So 20. Seventeen. Phil McConkey certified emerald mirror signature. And two out of five. So I was really happy to get that card. I used to have his autograph. I got rid of it when I resold my collection. But this one I'm keeping on to, and this is actually a nicer collection than I had the first time. So, I'm in good shape. Twenty eleven threads YA Tittle Heritage Collection. Not numbered, nice card. But picked up for my vintage stuff.
No, he's not a giant anymore, and he's not very liked. But, I couldn't pass this up because it was cheap enough. A Landing Collins 2017, I think. Yeah. Uh, purple, number 7 out of 10. Parallel. So, I just picked that up because it was so cheap. And it was number 10, so... That'd be a wrong piece to get. Pick this one up cheap in the normal value on eBay, so I had to buy this. It was a 1970 Tops Fran Tarkenden card. Um, these I've seen much more expensive than what I got it for, so I was happy to pick this bad boy up for the price it was at. Got a few more to go. This is a nice one to pick this up as my big Manning pickup for the week. 2004 Press Pass, his rookie year jersey card. Not numbered, but still I needed this for my set. And I have this towards my Mannings, which is nice to have. These are Mannings together. So I was glad to get that one. Then I picked up this 2020 Spectra Andrew Thomas, numbered 70 out of 99. I think it's the black parallel. So that was pretty much a nice pickup, and I was happy to do that. Twenty twenty select number two one sixty two out of two hundred nine. Jordan Yamamoto, uh, jersey autograph. So that was one of the ones I picked up. Uh, the Yamamotos. I think I'm done after that with the Yamamoto for a bit. Uh, just because I want to focus on the Giants and I don't have that extra money right now. I don't think this stuff's gonna go up too much right now. This stuff's pretty high as is. That's the other problem. And this won't seal up like four knocks, whatever this is. Oh. Yeah. Uh, I picked this up because it was on. I, I did pay a good amount, but I had to get this. 2010 Threads Phil Sims Gridiron Kings dual jersey numbered 55 out of 150. So that was pretty cool. Very happy about that. And yeah. And last but not least, the red prism, red wave, I guess. Number 148 or 149, rookie red prism, Xavier McKinney. So I really add to my McKinney collection again. <laughs> about 10 more cards. Hopefully getting more in soon. Um, next up is this box. I've been wanting to open this one. So I had this when I was younger. Uh, I opened it. I'm going to keep it sealed this time. I got this from the bottom. I think I got this for seven dollars delivered. I can't even believe how much it was to lift, like how cheap it was, considering what they go for online. But it is the Ron Dane starting lineup from his rookie year. 
He was in the extended series, but this is his rookie starting lineup. I just had to pick that up because I used to have it. And I wanted another one. When I went looking for a Ron Dane rookie, uh, SPX rookie. And all they have is graded, so I'm gonna on that. So these are some lots that I won. Uh, I'm gonna open them up first. I'll open this one up first because it was from eBay. It's a pretty nice lot. Uh, but I'm gonna do this one first from Com C. I waited for this one since November. It finally came three months later, <laughs> which is nice of them. So these were things that I had one that had some nice value to it. Uh, I think to sell shows the Jill Masters in Red SP, the James Bond, uh, Dalton SP, the J Pierce Bronson SP, Carson Kuhlman Canvas. This Doctor Strange, Benedict Wong, and Benedict Cumberbatch dual relic, not numbered or anything, but and a canine patch of a Norfolk Terrier. So I just picked these up thinking they might, you know, I had some credit and I just wanted to use them. So I wanted to pick up stuff that I could possibly sell something of. I'm not really a seller like that when I am, but that's stuff that I don't keep. So, then I did a mojo break of 2020 contenders because there's no way I was paying $600 for a box and I can just try to get my guys get what I get. I might do another one just because they're cheap enough. Because I still got a lot to look for. But I did get my Darnay Holmes autograph. So that was pretty cool. Um, and then I got a bunch of base of Jones, Shepard, Barkley, Shepard, Jones, Jones, Barkley, Shepard, Shepard, Barkley, Jones, Shepard, Shepard, Barkley. So I need one of each of these. And the rest can be sold. I don't really collect multiple Giants cards, so whatever. But still nice to get three base cards I need. I'm probably going to do another break tonight, most likely. If it's still there by the time we get done with this, uh, I'll probably do it. And then I want these. So I paid a little bit more this time. I think I paid $7. But all in all, I'll make my money back because when you see what's in here, it was worth it. It's taking a while to open these up. So this was a 
It's a huge lot I want online. Starting with the 1996 Sports, or it's a Sports Stars. Frank Thomas won a 15,000 gold card. The Absolute Red Zone, Derrick Henry. A Elite Red, Derrick Henry, number 201 at 299. A Will to Win, Derrick Henry, at Rookies and Stars Base. A Stargazing Green Prism, Aaron Judge. Number 146 at a, I mean 46 at a 125. Aaron Judge Fire. Uh, insert. Just forget which one this is, but it's, it is an insert. Stadium Club Chrome, Aaron Judge. Base. A Certifying Green, Aaron Judge. A Season Ticket Purple, Aaron Judge, not numbered. A Tory Holt, Sw Sunday Swatch. A Al Albert Azalea Purple Refractor, number 17 out of 250. Austin Meadows Blue Refractor, it looks like, or Purple, whatever. It's a refractor of some sort, number 20 out of 150. Unless they're not purple, I don't know what the color they are, but. A Prism Derrick Henry Green, not numbered. A Kickoff Green Derrick Henry. Thunder and Lightning Henry and. Delaney Walker and a Derrick Henry Press Proof Blue. Like I said, I think I paid seven dollars for the lot, and basically these are all going to be a dollar each, dollar to three dollars. Uh, so it's still a pretty good deal for me. Um, I hope everyone has a wonderful weekend. I will see you soon. I will have another video pretty soon, actually, because I have more mail coming in, including a really nice Giants, vin uh, old school Giants pickup. So I hope to see you with that, and have a nice one. Peace.